don't know why I'm thinking like this. And I'm very gonna, slightly yeah, looking at her side. phone. And I was like, very nicely, I think. How uh, was it doing? <laughs> side eye throwbacks. Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Jyoti Hewitt. Truthy. What's up, Joe? What's up? <laughs> Ms. Bola's back. Ms. Bola's yeah. back. And so yeah. is Dino James. Yeah. Listen, yeah. Um, apparently he, he did the song called Girlfriend way back in the day. Okay. Um, what is way back in the day? I mean, now don't say something like that and all. No, no. Okay, okay fair enough. Before <laughs> the channel. Well before. <laughs> Pretty good. So, um, and now he's got this and I got requests for it, but it's got part one and part two. So and both parts released back then, or is it like oh, one part just? Yeah, abhi, Achha, one month ago, part one released oh. one month ago. This is a boyfriend. That was girlfriend. Huh. It's like a oh. follow up to that song, but not a follow up. Achha. But because he did girlfriend, like, he's done boyfriend. That's all I know. Okay, and this this song today, boyfriend His has boyfriend, two parts. Two part, parts. Part, part one and two released okay. one month ago, and part Take two care. released two weeks ago. So with okay. a two week gap. So okay. I've been told react to both uh, together. Together, to get okay. the story. So they claim what it says. This is a story. Is... Okay, I like shocks. Um, yeah. Boyfriend is a song where Dino where Dino James portrays the insecurities and toxicity that an individual can go through in a relationship and the trauma that follows if they let themselves fall deep into the dark hole of insecurities. Okay, and an uncomfortable truth that a lot of people face. Through the song, Dino has a strong message. If this is what people face, then best for both parties to walk away. Toxicity and trauma is never okay. A chaw. Hmm. Written Dino James, primary okay. artist Dino James, bluish music, and says on the beat. Says on the beat, boy. boy. Music producer, <laughs> bluish music. Additional production says, okay, Abhishek Arthur. Okay, and let me just quickly see. The, we're go, we're going to watch both back to back. This cool. says, boyfriend rep, rep, reprise. The song offers a raw and honest plea of running away from toxicity, own thoughts, insecure nature of an individual. This reprise is a nonchalant expression of Dino James, wherein through his powerful lyrics and emotional delivery, he sheds light on an important issue that is often overlooked and ignored in our society. He has a strong message okay. for the ones who are facing such insecurities. You shouldn't let such insecurities consume you or bother you. Choose to walk away and cut off the insecurities when needed. Okay, fine. Take care. Easier see. said than done, but yes, that's the message. Let's watch both. Let's see what's done. Happening. Ready. One, two, part one. Huh? One, ah. two, three, play. कभी वो बहुत और लगती कभी कुछ ज्यादा ही क्यूट पर मैं एक स्मॉल टाउन लड़का ये आई एम ट्राइंग टू बी द डूड हां मैं जानता हूं अच्छे से कि वो ज्यादा है मासूम पर पता नहीं मुझे खुद चीजों का क्यों चाहूं मैं प्रूफ अच्छा लग रहा हूं ना चेक करता रहता जब भी उसके साथ कोई हंस तो नहीं रहा मुझ पे उड़ा तो नहीं रहा मजाक बस सहमा सहमा रहता हूं और रहता हूं घबराए चाहता हूं हर पल मुझसे बोले यो मा परफेक्ट गाय कुछ गड़बड़ है हमेशा कहता रहता ये दिमाग रहता क्वेश्चन मार्क और ढूंढू उसके कैरेक्टर पे दाग हमेशा रखना चाहूं पास और करता रहता हूं शिनाक पकड़ू मैं रंगे हाथ ढूंढता रहता हूं मैं चांस कैसे मेरे बिन समझ नहीं आता हंस लेती है वो मैं तो उसके बिन हर किसी को बस कह देता हूं नो मिस करता हूं उसको रोज बस करता नहीं हूं मैं शो मैसेज का वेट करता हूं ताकि मैं कर पाऊं इग्नोर हम साथ है फिर भी लगता है तुझे करता हूं मैं चेस कभी मुझे अपनी लगती कभी लगती है गेस काश ये सारे ठेस तुझे बता पाऊं मैं बेब्स आई विश तुझे रख पाऊं मैं सजा के इन अ केस तुझे रखना मैं चाहूं दुनिया से महफूज क्यों बन गया हूं मैं सहमा सजा सुस क्यों खुद के लगाए इस आग से मुझे तो बचा ले बन गया हूं कैसी भी अजीब सी स्टोरी पास 
शायद अभी उसके टच में है छुपा रही है कोई रास उसके सामने नॉर्मल रहता हूँ पहना रहता सो मास्क फिर इंस्टा में उसके घुस के करता रहता हूँ जांच कोशिश करता रहता उसके फोन का कैसे खोलू लॉक फट के हाथ में आ जाती है जब फोन आता है स्विच टॉक्सी मस्त राइडिंग में था बॉस ऐसे ख्वाब देते ख्वाब सुंग चुपके सुमे उसके सारे पहने उतरे टॉप हमेशा कहती मेरा भाई है वो हर राम जाता से उसके मैसेजेस गलती से मैंने कर लिए थे रीड हे सीट कैन यू स्पीक व्हेन डी नो गोस टू स्लीप मुझ पे कर रही थी वो चीट वो हर राम सादी ब्रिज ब्रिज कंफर्म में हर शब्द है बस चंचन जब पढ़ जाए तू कंफर्म में लौंडे हर दम कहेंगे तेरे लायक तू कंसर्न है जनवन हम दम तभी तो बेटर राय तू कम दम दम का दे है ब्रम दस फाइव में पी के टाइ तू मन करन लिखे सारे ग्रंथ उसमें है टाइ तू मन धन करता हूँ और सत्संग उसकी वजह है तू कौन सिम का यालो के गन पर ये वापस आए क्यों लक्षण है सब जन कहेंगे मुझे सारे Yeah. You know? I hope he doesn't kill her. There's a part two. You okay. can't. Very dark. Very quickly, you know. मैं तेरे को सारी रात फोन ट्राई कर रहा था कहाँ गई थी तू आई स्लेप चली बे पर सुबह से तू पी रहा है क्यों? चल साली प्रोस दूर रह मुझसे समझी ना तू अरे पर हुआ क्या है व्हाट द फक इज रॉन्ग विद यू बताओ इनके प्यार में पड़ा था और ये खेल रही थी गेम्स मेरे नाम से जोड़ा नेम और कई और हो रहे कपड़े चेंज शट द फक अप डू यू इवन नो व्हाट यू आर सेइंग शट द फक अप मेरा नाम अपने मुंह से लेना नहीं अगेन अरे पर हुआ क्या है मुझे एटलीस्ट बताएगा क्या तू तेरा फोन देखा सिड के साथ मस्त मचा रही है ना तू और देखा सामने आई कि है ना बेटा एंड मे ट्रूथ अच्छा करता होगा स्मूथ और तू भेज रही होगी न्यूज़ आई कांट बिलीव इट सिड मेरा भाई है अच्छा भाई के साथ में सोकर आई है सही है बेटा सही है शट अप शट अप तेरी गलती नहीं है इट्स रियली नॉट योर फॉल्ट तुम सारे साले सेम हो डैम यू फक यू ऑल मुझे तेरी सोच पे जाने क्यों तरस आता है टी यू नो नीड अ फकिंग पार्टनर यू नीड अ फकिंग डॉल तेरे बाप दादा ने डाली है तेरे अंदर गंदी सोच बस यही तुम्हारा मेक है दिस इज योर जर्न कोड डोंट यू फकिंग टच मी लीव मी मुझे छोड़ तेरी शक और इनसिक्योरिटी का नहीं है कोई तो गर्ल्स को प्रोडक्ट समझते हैं ऑलमोस्ट सारे मैन पर तू तो एकदम परफेक्ट था ना टेन आर ऑफ टेन मतलब जो भी तूने किया था वो करा था प्रिटेन मैं पागल थी जो सोच रही थी कि माय डी इज डिफरेंट हाँ मैं सिद्धि रात भर चुपके चुपके बातें करती थी तुझे प्रपोज करने का आइडिया कोई लग नहीं रहा था ठीक पर तू शक में इतना अंधा था ऑब्वियसली यू कान सी की घर पे मैंने बोल दिया है विल यू मैरी मी Okay, I have. Let's just watch part two because I will like. So who's the girl? Who's the girl? Benamsha just... Suna Wala. I'm seeing her. She's really now. good, huh? She's a good actor. Very nice. Uh, like, no, she even, like even delivered her lines the... with so much emotion. Very nice. And and the lines which were given were like proper. It was like yeah. kind of rhymey and in a hip hop style. So that was really nice. And yeah, chalo, we'll discuss it once once this thing. But I do want to I'm add smart. that while a lot of it I was I'm in smart. the middle like. I was like, are we? Are we going to watch it? Are we? Are, are you actually? Do, are we still reacting? Are we going I to stop? I was very angry. Yeah, but uh, it takes a lot to put this kind of thought, and especially when you're questioning it, and you know that you know because all the elements are being spoken about it. So mm-hmm. it takes a lot to actually put your personal life out in the open like that. Your thought, especially that this is how you think, and you wished you didn't think like this, but still you do think like that. It takes a lot to be that honest. But I don't know if uh, it's it's really him. At the cost him. of, like he, I think it's impossible to write the song issue. if one isn't. 
an issue there are plenty issues maybe but it's maybe but to get into that psyche ha huh, maybe he has had that maybe he has seen friends have that and he is kind of like ye society mein exist karta hai ye mindset i need to address it and write a song about it so maybe he's done it from possibly outsider. possibly then i'm saying he was a very good actor but yeah, jo kyunki jo emotions aa rahe the they were very like real although right in the true. beginning i have to say the moment it started i was song wise i was a little like like you know voice texture and everything wise then i think midway through i got used to it or mm-hmm. maybe that got better i don't know what happened but either way so i was focusing let's... on the only the story the same. video hai na same, same. this is but let's one. see yeah. what the next thing is yeah Stalled cute it. done then we'll talk okay 1 2 3 play I would not let him. T- yeah. सारी रातें सारे दिन ये बस दिखते प्रश्न चिन्ह ये कि वफा याद क्या इरादा है मुझे काटे और खरोचे मन चीखे मुझको नोचे बरदास मेरी थोड़ा ज्यादा है तुझे रख लू काश मैं सजा के कांच में तुझे देखे ना कोई तीसरा तू दुआ या बदुआ सब है रोशन या धुआ कहीं कर दे ना मुझे सरफिरा तुझे रखना मैं चाहूँ दुनिया से महफूज क्यों बन गया हूँ मैं सहमा सचा सुस क्यों खुद के लगाए इस आग से मुझे तू बचा ले करता हूँ कैसी भी अजीब सी स्टोरी में करने लगा हूँ खुद से ही मुंहोरी में चैन सुकून में करता हूँ तेरे हवाले Okay. 
Yeah, I don't know if people like this exist. Men like this exist, no? Clearly they do. Yeah, yeah. And they don't talk about it. Which is why I was like, I'm glad that he's talking about it. Whether it's his story, whether it's what he's seen around him. Mm. But, uh, and here's the thing. The one very big aspect which they showed, the woman being, at least she knew that this is not the kind of person. She had enough self-respect at that point to walk away. Uh, 90% of people who attract such I'll call it insecurity in a man and a person who is that insecure. 90% of those women, the issue is that they have messiah complexes. I will fix it. It's okay. He has this problem. But with me, I will be able to fix this in him. They have that issue. So that's when the problem really begins because no one walks away. Oh. One person knowing that they are you know, toxic keeps saying that I know I'm toxic. And I'm sorry about it. I don't know how to fix it. Like how in his chorus, he kept saying, Na, karta hu tere havale, mujhe bachale, all those. So for women who have issues, ke, the savior complex that ha, main bachangi, ha, I will fix you or you will change. I will give enough love. And such men also oh, want that. A, a, but that's the narrative that so gets created. Toxic. It's just it such is. a toxic dynamic. Yeah. And this whole, yeah. this messiah complex is another whole issue of its own. Like you are not <laughs> here to mother grown men. Grown men have to have yes. become adults in their mind and life on their own. You are not. The, it's not the your reason job. we have found, and the reason I have found him, is because I have it in me to fix the side of it. I will heal him. If I More than mothering, it becomes no. the narrative one keeps talking about is I will be the healer in his life. Oh. I will fix him. Most men who are womanizers, so as to say, you know, uh, they also attract women who are fixers, who are that okay. He's been like this, but I will heal him. I will heal him of all his trauma. So healers, uh, displaced healers mixed with uh, misplaced stalkerism syndrome or whatever this one wants to be. Insecurities pro max ultra S. <laughs> that is, and it is so right that in the start, like, the, you know, that whole excerpt that you read out, which said that with mm. such toxicity, it's important to walk away. And which is why I'm, you know, because everything is written actually in a very progressive and a positive way. Mm. The song itself is very like, you stop and you think, hey, yaar, main kyun sun rahi hai? and do yeah. I even want to continue? Is this a yeah. kind of music? And then one realizes that, hey, no, this There's is by design. Yeah. There's a purpose to it. He's, yeah. he's, he's trying to create something which is putting a message out there, especially for all those people who do this, but don't even acknowledge to themselves that they're doing this. Mm. Which is why with that honesty to be actually, you know, to put it out there, hey, this mm. is huge. Like it's a, it's a big, this thing. No props to him for taking on that initiative. Because yeah. this is the male toxic mindset yeah. is very prevalent. And clearly, um, and like she also said, Ki ye pass on hota hai. you don't just, you're not born with it. It's Correct. kind of conditioned and programmed into your brain through the things in your environment, right? Correct. Um, and she's seen it before because she was like, all this are the same and it's a conditioning. And I thought that my yeah. Dino is different. I told my family that he's different and I haven't seen this. He's not like those others, uh, which she's probably seen. So again, Correct. the whole so like, repeating a that, pattern in her life as well. Correct. Yeah, the whole thing is Correct. that um, just trying to drive home the, the, the commonality. It's so common. Yeah. It's actually more common than we think it is. Uh, Correct. Which yeah. is scary. I have not. I it's very scary. Heard, I have not really. Um, that I was not. Huh. I've not come across. No, like yeah, but I have yeah. to. I have to say that the whole like, um, if this is prevalent and if this is there, it just um, yes, there is something to be said that when you find the right person for yourself and your vibe and energy is right, you do sort of heal each other's past um uh, scars and Traumas, you know, that yeah. whole thing is there. But there will never be a healthy, happy relationship if you enter it in a non-healed way you know yeah and yeah. that's the whole cr crux of it he is not healed from his insecurities and so he's not and this is also coming entering Correct. a partnership so then Correct. there has to be that Correct. thing of i will fix him or i will yeah. make sure i'm so faithful to him and loyal to him that he'll never will have trust issues again or he'll never no Correct. it's not your job to fix him he needs to understand that he's entering a relationship with you because you are a person of certain values so he can't be no, this also comes from his... society based things that for example there is so much oppression that till a certain age oh don't meet boys don't meet girls don't there's so much don't 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 that you know that whole Maybe. thing that mm -hmm. oh are that everybody's cheating on everyone oh this is and then you don't know how to be in a relationship because nobody's ever taught you the only narrative one knows is Oh, ladko se baat mat karo, ladkiyon se baat mat karo. When you're really young, right? Now, mm. thankfully, in a lot of places, that is changing. It has already changed. But the end result of it is this: when you don't know how to be in a relationship, and then you get into it, and you say, "Hey, every like," but if she's in a relationship with me, I need to be her end and be all. 
just like how she's my end and be all that you know that one line right in the start he said that um, i watch her when she's spending time with others and i don't want her like i make all my plans only with her so how come she's making but plans not you, with me very chipko don't please don't be with anyone exactly. who does that you need exactly. to have your individuality and like and that's coming from a societal thing yeah. that is the whole issue that mm-hmm. you know when you grow up in oppression this is what happens then then you cr- create a oppressive thing forget your partner for yourself you create that oppression you know system within you mm-hmm. and then whoever you meet you're meeting them and you expect them to follow that because that's your love language also, that's all that you understand yeah also i feel like you are uh, uh, you if you've seen only broken relationships around you or people who cheat around you you will think that yeah. wo normal normal life hai aur wohi hota hai wo kisi cheat kar rahi hai kisi baat kar rahi hai yeah Correct. and if you feel and if you only seen um um uh people be with each other for superficial reasons and then move on to the next you will think that that's how life is that's what happens yep. ye ye yep. hi hai you know um and then if you also another thing is if you yourself are someone who doesn't care about being loyal then you will automatically suspect the other person of being the same way it's like correct i am a disloyal person so i think everyone else is like that hence i will i will but itni clarity hoti nahi hai this thing that you're talking about this manifest in the way i am the very loyal हाँ अगर मुझे कभी चांस मिला तो यू नेवर नो बट आई एम नॉट डूइंग इट राइट नाउ बट दिस पर्सन माइट बी बिकॉज हे पीपल डू इट मतलब गिवन अ चांस आई मीन इट्स बोथ या दैट्स व्हाट आई एम सेइंग लाइक इदर दे हैव सीन इट सो मच यू आर राइट यू आर बैंग ऑन यू आर बैंग ऑन अबाउट इट इट्स जस्ट सैड इट्स जस्ट सैड बिकॉज़ दिस दैट्स नॉट Listen. it's I, i knew this is going to go into a podcast discussion i know i was feeling yeah. it as the prolog was progressing i was like i can't i can't it's making me very angry i want to punch him but sure. well done well done dino but, james for putting it yeah, out there because it's it a very be about. sensitive thing to talk about and to be and and to be able to enact it in such a way that the whole thing has come across perfectly like and you know also, it's huh, the, the correct pinchy points are coming out you know which trigger people who are watching enough yeah. like us to have this discussion in such detail like who saw just relax it's a song it's only a song don't uh, explode uh, so no but yes exactly hats off to him and the thing is he took the toxicity to another level also he said yeah. ye to bahut extreme hai you know and in the end like the things he was saying to her and the name calling and all i was just like i would like walk out of the room just walk out of the room because this is not someone you need to address. don't allow anyone to speak to you that way ever ever especially not your partner even if they are angry even when you're angry your actions are still in your control it's not you know anger alcohol these things are uh these things are like crutches of the weak minded you know oh i was drunk but i really like i, I really like how they showed it no. though like even i would have walked out like you know how you said right now that if you were in such a situation you would have just walked out i would have done exactly that i would have walked out but i like the way they took she stood there she spoke what she needed to with that narrative. much clarity yeah. correct with that much clarity telling a person that this is what i was planning and mm-hmm. this is how you are behaving and these are the reasons you are behaving like this this is who you are here's your mirror yeah. and now i will leave you know because so i like i like this whole way she the way she kind of He she was didn't, leaning no, she, on her, and I was getting irritated. I was like, "Get no, your hands off!" In the end, then, yeah, in the end, <laughs> that moment when they showed that she's yeah, yeah, like she's his like, his hand there, she's about to kiss his forehead, and then she just kind of says, "No, I'm done." Like you know, she does that, and then she like that's where they ended it. But I like that she kind of gave yeah. it off. Also, most of us would have just walked away and said, "No, I know." Your issue. Yeah. Also, also uh-huh. was like when someone says those kind of things to you, they've crossed yeah. that line. There's they've always that imaginary boundary. line Correct. between yeah. people and humans in general, and especially in in a in between a couple. Um, once that line is crossed, uh, no matter how much they apologize or whatever, it will always be crossable again. And then the Correct. whole dynamic yeah. and the it's like once the glass is broken, you cannot put it back together. That's it. Correct. It's broken. So I feel like um, while it her pain and her hurt was evident because you're like. it was going so well i was so in love with this guy yeah. why did you ruin it like she's so frustrated with him because she's like i was on the verge of proposing to you why did you ruin it why did you ruin but it but here's the it thing if you're in a committed serious relationship do you not see these traits about a person it's very difficult to hide no, these traits i'm telling you it is not impossible to yeah? not see them yeah yeah it's mm. kind of, the thing is he didn't make it very obvious he was very good Correct. at hiding he kept his hiding. and he kept saying that i don't know why i'm thinking like this and i'm very slightly yeah, looking at side. the phone and i was like very nicely like how is it going side eye pro max uh so anyway i feel like <laughs> it's this is people are good actors that's why people yeah, yeah, yeah. get fooled yeah. all the time in life so yeah. um so anyway i feel like that end scene like yes in real life walking away is it 
nobody should be allowed to talk to you like that but yes she the, for the sake of the video and the narrative and the story they were telling it was a nice mirror showing and obviously um letting him know that he's messed up big time and lost a good thing so and it's scary and i hope they don't show like a part 2 where she goes back to him because it would be scary after no, this no. when something like this happens like you know between he said couple... he walk away Oh, message. Yeah, exactly. That's the message. Because that's after this, if a it's scary to go back to a man like oh this, because like you said, if the line is crossed, next you don't know where it's where all it's going to go into. Mm. You can, yeah. uh, such a man needs to work on himself and fix himself first, yeah. and then like you know, yeah. Even if oh. even if you're so angry, I don't know how you can call your partner names like that. It's just I don't know. Yeah. It's just a it's yeah. A, it's a mindset thing. It's a, that shows the person's yeah. mindset more than what yes. they. you know think about you but then yeah. then you have to decide are you okay with a person who speaks and thinks like this sometimes even when you call a person out for speaking things like this because you know in a fight a person tries to hit you where it'll hurt the most and these are some of the most hurtful things what he was speaking so this is what i'm saying it's a very it's I such a know. it's conditioning abhi hum, it's upbringing it's mindset it's value system yeah, it's a lot of things ab hum kar rahe hain kaise hai ye bare mein ha bas ho gaya ab ho gaya bas i said i was just like woosa i need to get some wine now chai se kaam nahi hoga to relax okay so very nice uh, i think important message uh, given by dino yeah. through his song and uh, props to him for doing that and taking on that role as uh, as evil and villainish as he had to look himself for it Yeah. Um. So let's see when part two comes out. I thought that was part two. Honestly, that's why I was like, "Huh." But no. Okay. All those toxic thoughts. If you're having them, please go and fix yourself. Don't. No, no. Don't fix yourself. Don't fix yourself. Visit a actually a therapist. That's and not I mean. in a bad way. Yeah. Two things too. No, a lot of people think, "Are you going to fix it?" Okay. No, no. Please get help. Help. Ki zarurat ki, yeah. Help. Yes. Ki zarurat hai. Us moment mein, and yeah. there is no shame in going to a therapist. Yeah. Go and generally talk your heart out. You But need an external perspective. Koi sunne wala chahiye. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Huh. So great. On that note, let me know what else we should get to. Miss Bola is there on Insta. Do do do. You know the drill. Please hit those buttons. We'll see you soon. Live long and prosper. Be kind to each other. <laughs> yeah. Seriously. <laughs>